this your captain speaking. Welcome aboard Republican Airlines Flight 600 to Orange County, California. Now, <laughs> you may have heard all that fake news about the so-called Rona virus. Well, to ensure the safety of every soul on board, my co-pilot will be wearing a mask and washing his hands throughout the flight. You know, today we're operating at 125% capacity, so those of you in the standing section, hold on to your MAGA hats. <laughs> Take it away, flight attendant. Woo! Thank you, Captain, and thank you all for flying Republican Airlines, where we encourage our first-class passengers to enjoy their hard-earned white privilege by relaxing into their Corinthian leather recliners. Please take a moment to find the safety instructions located in the seat pocket in front of you. Your seat belts have been designed for easy fastening and release. We strongly encourage the parents on board to be good role models and use your seat belts to discipline your children. Ow! Should cabin pressure change drastically while in flight, oxygen masks will drop down from the overhead bins in the first class cabin. Passengers in coach are instructed to wait patiently for the oxygen to trickle down. In the event of a water landing, the gun and Bible located under your seat cushion may be used as a flotation device. I would like to remind everyone that this is a non-smoking flight. But we're working on that. <laughs> Till we get our freedoms back, nicotine patches may be purchased upon request. Uh, this is your captain? Just got word from the tower there's going to be a delay. Appears to be some sort of hullabaloo at the John Wayne Airport. Some protesters are looking to change the name and tear down the Duke statue in the lobby. Uh, we'll keep you posted as we get word. Uh, this your captain, uh, flight attendant. Thank you, Captain. You know, they could have named that damn airport Mel Gibson International, as far as I'm concerned. <laughs> Would not be something. Captain, speakers on, baby. I'll tell you what, that old Mel is a class act. Uh, speakers on, baby. What? God darn it. How do you turn this damn thing off? Oh, all right. Uh, flight attendant? Thank you, Captain. For those of you who are wondering, meal service will be provided on this flight. First class passengers will receive delicacies from the Trump family and Dangered Species Cookbook. Today's specialty will be grilled sea otter with a burgundy baby seal sauce and a side of double condor eggs. For the takers in coach, sometime in the next 45 minutes, a giant Slim Jim will be rolled down the aisle. Uh, this your captain. Sorry to interrupt again, baby doll. That's all right, baby. Folks. We got an update from the tower that the Antifa-loving lefty mob has now moved over to Starbucks in Terminal 1 and are overloading the entire dang computer system with their custom orders for soy, milk, chai, mocha, double froth, liberal-loving drinks, which in turn is interfering with the flight tower's navigational system. So, it looks like it's going to be a while. We'll be heading back to the gate until uh, further notice. Flight attendant. Thank you, Captain. Well, looks like our first class passengers are going to have time to deep plane to the captain's lounge where y'all can stretch out at the open bar and sample the light buffet. In keeping with the spirit of fiscal responsibility to our shareholders, we'll be turning off the air conditioning in coach. Uh, flood tenant, there's a fruity drink with an umbrella in it waiting for you at the lounge. Thank you, Captain. Oh, as you can see, the captain has turned on the fasten seatbelt sign, so y'all don't need to be getting it up and touching things while we're away. We thank you for choosing Republican Airlines, the airline that is not pro-choice. Flight attendant, come on. Coming, baby.